Hey guys, so as you can see, I've already had my lemon water for the morning and then 20 minutes later I had my celery juice and I wanted to share with you guys something else that I have been adding lately to my morning routine and I have been absolutely loving it. It's really been helping with my immune system and I think it really helps with my skin as well. And yeah, I've been doing it regularly enough that I figured I should really show you what it is and how I make it. So you may have seen them in some of my other videos, but what I'm going to be showing you today is my turmeric, ginger, garlic, orange juice shots. Like I said, I've been making them every single morning and I drink them after I have my celery juice. Of course, I wait like 20 to 30 minutes um, before drinking it. I know it sounds really weird, especially because there's garlic in there and you know, it's a pretty spicy drink actually, but it is oddly very addicting and I think it tastes really, really good. So I wanted to share it with you guys in hopes that maybe you would be inspired to try it as well because there is nothing but good health benefits that you can get from a shot like this. Okay, so I have cut up all of the different parts of this turmeric, ginger, garlic, orange juice shot. And some people make it with more of certain ingredients, some people make it with less. But what I always do is I take one orange and I cut it up, and I take one to two garlic cloves. I take, I don't really measure it out, but I take about this much turmeric. This is kind of a lot, um, but I'm gonna use it all anyway. This is another little piece of turmeric. And then I take a small slice of ginger because the ginger can make it really, really spicy and add a lot of heat. So I don't like it to be too, too spicy. So I only add about that much. And then basically what I do is after I've done cutting it all up, I just run it through my juicer. So one of the reasons that I started making these turmeric shots is because I read about them in uh, Medical Medium's Life Changing Foods book. And in it he has, you know, this exact turmeric shot. Now the recipe is a little bit different from the way that I make it in that it the recipe that he has in here calls for more ingredients of each thing. So like for instance, it says, I'll just show you, hold on. So for instance, it calls for four inches of turmeric. I don't use that much. It calls for four inches of ginger. I also don't use that much. Two oranges and four garlic cloves. I clearly don't use that much. And then um, the directions are a little bit different in that you juice them each separately and then add them together at the end. This is totally fine. Like anyone who wants to do it that way can do it, but I personally just don't want to do that. Um, so I just do it all together at once. It's really easy it makes it way faster yeah it still works you still get all the benefits from all of the ingredients so yeah i just do it all together it's a really great recipe and i'm so grateful that it was in his book because i like i said i think that the juice has really helped with my immune system and that's one of the things that the juice is supposed to do so basically ever since i've started juicing these turmeric shots, I really, I cannot think of a time that I have gotten sick since I have been juicing these. And I've been traveling a lot and spending, you know, I'm around people who are sick, but I don't get sick. And so, you know, one of the things that I really have to thank, I think for that is these turmeric shots. Now, some other really great benefits that these turmeric shots impart on the person who drinks them is obviously turmeric is very anti-inflammatory and so is ginger. 
so are all the ingredients really, but turmeric is really known for being a powerful anti-inflammatory. So that's one reason that it's really great. Ginger is um, really good for digestion. It's really good for actually relaxing the body and um, relieving muscles, uh, tight muscles. Uh, it sort of has this effect on the body where it just like relaxes you. And then garlic is a very potent, you know, natural antibiotic. It's also antiviral, antifungal, antiparasitic, anti everything that you do not want in your life and in your body. So that's another really great thing. Um, and Oranges are obviously, they're very high in vitamin C, they're high in calcium, and they taste good. They make the shot taste really good. This shot is really great if um, you just want to boost your immune system, and also if you feel like you're coming down with a cold or flu, it will help fight off the cold and flu um, and help you get over it so much quicker. One other really cool thing that I wanted to add was this note in the tips section of the book about turmeric and ginger juice together. And it says, if you're dealing with congestion, a cough, sore throat, cold flu, and or sinus problems, try juicing fresh turmeric and ginger together to make a small dose of concentrated serum. Periodically throughout the day, take any time, sorry, <laughs> take tiny sips. Um, the juice will act as an expectorant and help speed up the healing process. I mean, how cool is that? I mean, if you're coming down with a cold or flu and have like, mucus going on like of course you would want um to get rid of that because that's not fun you can't breathe easily and it just you know it's not fun being sick you can't taste anything and yeah you want to feel healthy and you know good so that's another great reason to do it so anyways i am going to clean up my juicer and then drink my turmeric shot all right, about to drink this turmeric, ginger, garlic, orange juice shot. Um, so here we go. Cheers. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> that is spicy. Oh my God. Ooh. Sometimes it makes me red in the face. I can literally like I can feel the spice in my nose and, you know, just like, just comes through my face. Um, but it's so good and it's so worth it. Also, I was thinking I'm probably gonna get a lot of questions about this juice, um, especially about the garlic. I get a lot of questions on Instagram about whether or not the garlic um, makes my breath smell. And I find that um, when I drink it in the morning, what I do, obviously, as you can see, is I have all my juices in the morning, and then after that, I will eat something, um, like a smoothie or, you know, my blueberry banana mash with the spirulina and barley grass juice powder. But anyway, after I eat something, the smell of garlic goes away. So <clears throat> if you're worried about the garlic smell, I would recommend eating something afterwards or just brushing your teeth afterwards. Um, it does not linger for the rest of the day. Another question that I often get is, does it stain my juicer? And yes, it stains my juicer, but personally, I don't care if my juicer is stained. Um, that's a sign that I'm using it and that's what the juicer is for. Um, so yes, it can stain your juicer. I believe I've heard that baking soda, if you like scrub baking soda on the surface of, you know, wherever the turmeric has touched, that can help. But like I said, I, I've never tried it. I personally like, I don't care if my juicer is a little bit stained. So yeah, it's a little bit orange in color here. Let me show you. Like here, for instance, this is the, you know, plastic container that the juice, you know, drops down into. So you can see it's like a little bit, you know, yellowish orange and that's from the turmeric. So yeah, it, it will, it will stain things, um, but it's totally worth it. And the fact that it stains things so quickly shows you how strong and powerful it is um, because all that color is filled with all of the micronutrients, you know, antioxidants, um, things like that that are good for you. And then 
I know I'm gonna get this comment that I should add black pepper to <laughs> the juice. And the thing is, one of the things that I've learned from Medical Medium is that you don't need to add black pepper to turmeric to make it more uh, powerful or to increase the health benefits of it. I know that's kind of controversial because people just are really adamant about that belief. They really strongly believe that. And you know what? I say that if you strongly believe uh, the, you know, that black pepper is going to make it stronger, go ahead, add some black pepper to the juice. Um, but I've learned from Medical Medium you don't need to do that. I don't really feel called to add black pepper to my turmeric juice. I like the way it tastes without black pepper. And honestly, I think the things that are in there work synergistically together to enhance each other, like the turmeric and the ginger and you know, everything really, um, the garlic and the orange juice too. I think they all work well together to um, enhance each other's healing properties. Yeah, that's my feeling about the black pepper. So yeah, so if you would like to try it, I highly recommend trying it. You can also get Medical Medium's Life Changing Foods book. You can learn more about turmeric and ginger and garlic and oranges. He has a separate section about each of those foods and spices in the book, which is really incredible. And it's just, it's such a cool book. I, it's really cool to like learn about all of the health benefits that each of those foods provides. And then like the spiritual and emotional support even that the foods provide. So yeah, I would recommend that book and yeah. That is my video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm gonna get started on the rest of my work for the day and I will catch you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching and let me know in the comments if you try this shot and what you think of it. Okay, I'll see you next time. Bye.